Caravaggio is, has become synonymous with the term Baroque and he was a wild and fiery artist working in Rome who introduced a lot of new approaches to art. One of these was the use of chiaroscuro, which means light, the contrast of light and dark. And if you look at this particular portrait of Maffeo Barberini, you can see that part of the background is in shadow, part of it is in strong light, but it doesn't, that light source doesn't at this moment naturalistically fall on the side of the face. But it's that notion of using shadow as well as light to give a sort of psychological edge to the painting before the term psychological had ever been invented. But he also is very dynamic in the way he's open to ideas. There were a lot of northern artists working in Rome at the time and he was fascinated by their use of still life. And in this portrait you have in the foreground this beautiful glass vessel which has botanical studies of flowers, identifiable flowers within it. But you've also got this motif of a falling leaf floating in the surface of the water in the vase. That dynamic red slash that moves across Maffeo Barberini's gown is another element that leads the eye either upwards or else equally downwards. So it's a very dramatic work and it's many of his subjects become extremely passionate in nature. This is an early portrait, but, and we're perhaps more familiar with some of the later works, but he's uh, quite remarkable and has a huge influence on the artists coming to Rome at the time.